Hey guys, Shabazz here from Adams8908. My previous video was on the updates of WhatsApp, which has been recently released uh, for all of the WhatsApp users. So I've made a video on the features of uh, the new updates, but it has been discovered that there has been a lot of disappointment, a huge number of disappointments by the updates which has been recently released. User wants to get back to the old WhatsApp. They don't like the updates. They just want to get back to the older version of WhatsApp because that was quite convenient uh, to few of the users I mean again it depends upon the perception of the users so I thought of making a quick video where I'll show you guys how to get the old whatsapp back and how to uh, basically uh, remove the updated version of whatsapp so guys uh, first of all again you know I am not against the updates I'm not against it but I've seen lots of people who have been questioning me about how to get the old whatsapp back and that is the only reason why I'm making this video so yeah without wasting any further ado let's get started So before we start, I'm gonna show you guys that I have the updated version of WhatsApp installed in my phone. As you guys can see, uh, this is the updated version because we've got three or four, uh, you know, options at the top of the home page: the chats tab, the status tab, as well as the calls tab. This this status tab is new, so that means I've got the new version of WhatsApp installed in my phone. So I'm gonna first uninstall this uh, new version of WhatsApp. So we're gonna have to go to settings and we're gonna have to go to applications to uninstall. We won't be able to un directly uninstall the update, so we have to uninstall the whole application. I'm gonna uninstall this uh, version of WhatsApp. So I've uninstalled the updated version of WhatsApp. Now I'm gonna have to download the APK file from internet, which I have already done. So I'm gonna post the link down in the description to download the uh, previous version of WhatsApp. Uh, it will be an APK file. You guys can download the APK file. So just go ahead and install the previous version of WhatsApp by going to my download history and. Uh, clicking on this one this is the apk file by the way i'm gonna have to click on next next and install this version is uh, for 9th february 2015 so it's getting installed in my phone so it's been installed we don't have to open it now uh, we have to click on done so now we have to go to the play store first and we have to turn off the auto update feature of our phones so once we are in play store we're gonna have to click on here the three lines and now we have to scroll down and go to settings once we are in settings we have to go for the first option which says auto update apps click on it and go for the first option the first radio button uh, just tap the first button which says do not update apps and click on cancel and go back so since we have turned off the auto update feature the apps in your phone will not be auto updated so if you guys want to update you guys can go to the play store again you guys can click on the three lines here and you guys can come down to the settings now you guys can click on my apps and games so you guys will get all the apps which are installed in your phone if you guys want to update a specific app you guys can search for that app so if I want to update a specific app from here I can click on it and I can click on update in order to update that app guys that's how you manually update the apps on your phone it's really easy it's really convenient and it is really helpful guys a lot of times we have seen that all the apps get auto updated even though we don't want the updated version of that app it gets auto updated so it's really healthy practice to keep it manual since the apps gets auto updated uh, you know it eats the internal storage of your phone it is also a healthy practice to save the internal memory of your phone by keeping it on a manual mode once we are done with that we have to open the whatsapp now we have to click and agree now we're gonna have to put on our phone number and it's gonna wait for the message to self verify I'm gonna put in the name once I've given the name it's gonna go to the home screen so as you guys can see this is the older version of whatsapp I've got only three tabs on the top of the page and this is the older version of whatsapp so that's how you uh, get back to the older version of whatsapp guys before I end this video I would like to make one thing clear that I am NOT against the update which has been recently released by whatsapp I'm not against it if you guys like this video please click on the thumbs up button there so if you guys think that this video have been informative you guys can subscribe to my channel that's Adams 8908 uh, if you guys subscribe to my channel you guys will be getting the updates about my latest videos so if you guys have any questions you guys can write down your questions in the comments box down there thanks again guys for being a part of this video I'll talk to you guys in the next one peace